This was a memorable season for a number of reasons for Clay. Of course, COVID impacted their season just as it did everyone else's, but also they made the playoffs for just the second time in school history, and they won their first ever playoff game. Unfortunately, though, their playoff journey came to an end tonight as they fell to Brexville 49 to 33. Good game, baby. We dug ourselves in a little bit of a hole that we couldn't really fight our way back out of, but you know, Love my guys, extremely proud of them for everything that they did. You know, we kept fighting to the very end. We played our hearts out to the very end. I mean, we all wanted to be in this spot. We got our first, we made history last week, made our first playoff win. We, f we fought to get here. It would have been real easy after our regular season to fold our tent up, uh, you know, even last week and, and just kind of pack it in and, and play out the game. But obviously we, we won last week and, and we played to the bitter end here. Um, I'm extremely proud of that, uh, you know, their effort. The loss also ends the high school football playing careers of the entire Clay senior class, including quarterback Logan Heinchel. Nevertheless, it was a senior class that made history. Every single person in my family's went here, both my parents, my, uh, both my older sisters, both played soccer, and you know, I'm, I'm sure both of them probably have a few records of their own, but uh, it just, it, it, it felt amazing. To come out last week and after everything that had gone on this season to do what we did and bounce back the way we did last week, you know, it was we couldn't ask for anything more from anyone else on this team. We came in together, so uh, they've been through a lot. We've been through a lot together. Um, it's a special group. Uh, obviously, it starts with uh, Logan Heinzel, our quarterback. Um, but, you know, we've got uh, some senior old linemen that uh, definitely, uh, you know, ha have been through the grind and, uh, uh, just extremely proud of the whole class. While the Eagles are obviously disappointed about the loss tonight, they're also already excited for next year when they should have an even larger senior class led by their running back Jordan Petaway. From Brexville High School, Alex Wilcox, BCSN.